How to set up the Wavlink Ease Mesh Wi-Fi Network System Taking 531AX2 and 572HP3 as a demonstration Case 1, the mesh controller has been configured and the agent AP is not in the original factory settings. Preparation Check the hardware connection Confirm that the mesh router is successfully configured to access the internet. The front end router, or modem is wired to the WAN port of the mesh controller. Then making sure that the agent AP has been powered on. After that, browse and view the SIDS of mesh controller, and agent AP, mesh extender. Wavlink mesh underscore XXXX for mesh controller. Wavlink AC underscore XXXX and Wavlink and underscore XXXX for Agent AP, Mesh Extender. Step 1. Set 531X2 as a mesh controller. Connect the mesh controller via its Wi-Fi SID, Wavlink Mesh underscore XXXX, or Ethernet cable. Launch a browser on your PC. Enter http colon slash slash wifi dot wavlink dot com in the url bar then the router's web management login page appears enter the login password click login after entering the system setup interface select country region and time zone according to your needs create a new login password at the same time then click save Next, enter the wizard interface. Choose DHCP as your one type. Change the name of mesh network to ease mesh underscore test. Then you can alter the security type. And set up a new Wi-Fi password. Go apply. Wait for completion and exit. Note. The blue indicator on the mesh controller will be solid after setting. Step 2. Confirm whether there is only one mesh shooter before adding agent AP. Step 3. Set 572HP3 as an agent AP. Connect the agent AP via its Wi-Fi SID, Wavlink and underscore XXXX, or Wavlink AC underscore XXXX. The system will automatically pop up the Wi-Fi management interface. Then choose language, country region, time zone as you want. Create a new login password at the same time. Click save. Next, enter the wizard interface. Check, is a mesh agent. Then start pairing. After that, press and hold the pair button on the mesh controller for one tilde, two seconds within two minutes. The Wavlink indicator on the mesh controller keeps flashing. The status indicator on the agent AP keeps flashing at the same time. Showing that the agent AP and the mesh controller are in the pairing state. The Wavlink indicator stops flashing and turns solid blue. And the status indicator stops flashing and the above three Wi-Fi lights turn solid blue after a while. Which indicate the pairing is completed. Step 4. Check whether the mesh network has been set up. Basically, the indicators on the mesh controller and agent AP turn solid blue means the mesh network has been set up successfully. The following two ways 
can also help us determine the signal of the agent AP will disappear while the mesh network has only one SID of the mesh order. Connect the mesh controller via its Wi-Fi SID, ease a mesh underscore test. Launch a browser on your PC. Enter http colon slash slash wifi dot wavlink dot com in the URL bar. Then the router's web management login page appears. Enter the login password. Click login. Then you will find another extender option next to order in the mesh device list. Click Wi-Fi. Go, Mesh Network. Compared with the original one mesh order, here is an added extender. That means the mesh network has been set up. The above three methods can prove the success of mesh networking. Case 2. The mesh controller has been configured while the agent AP is in the original factory settings. One mesh controller supports up to six tilde, seven agent APs for networking. Just press and hold the pair button of the mesh controller and agent AP for one tilde, two seconds to pair within two minutes. Preparation. Check the hardware connection. Confirm that the mesh order is successfully configured to access the internet. The front end order or modem is wired to the WAN port of the mesh controller. Then making sure that the agent AP has been powered on. After that, browse and view the SIDs of mesh controller and agent AP mesh extender. Wavlink mesh underscore XXXX for mesh controller. Wavlink AC underscore XXXX and Wavlink and underscore XXXX for agent AP mesh extender. Step 1 pairing. Press and hold the pair button on the mesh controller for 1 tilde, 2 seconds. After that, the Wavlink indicator on the mesh controller keeps flashing. Then press and hold the pair button on the agent AP for 1 tilde, 2 seconds within 2 minutes. The status indicator keeps flashing at the same time. Showing that the agent AP and the mesh controller are in the pairing state. The Wavlink indicator stops flashing and turns solid blue. And the status indicator stops flashing and the above three Wi-Fi lights turn solid blue after a while, which indicate the pairing is completed. Step 2. Check whether the mesh network has been set up. Basically, the indicators on the mesh controller and agent AP turn solid blue means the mesh network has been set up successfully. The following T, Woways can also help us determine the signal of the agent AP will disappear while the mesh network has only one SID of the mesh order. Connect the mesh controller via its Wi-Fi SID, Wavlink mesh underscore XXXX. Launch a browser on your PC. Enter http colon slash slash Wi-Fi dot Wavlink dot com in the URL bar. Then the router's web management login page appears. Enter the login password. Click login. Then you will find another extender option next to order in the mesh device list. Click Wi-Fi. Go, mesh network. Compared with the original one mesh order, there is an added extender that means the mesh network has been set up. The above three methods can prove the success of mesh networking. If you meet any issues, please contact our technical support. Thanks for watching.